This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Man, he even has the best Plasma HGTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. Just you always Welcome to the... Real world. Just cute. Hot. Then I might send you a special well, footage for exciting I'm not paying $150 for it. Because Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. What's the point she plays it so shy. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class. It's so fucking boring. She's so fucking shy. She takes selfies with a giant tent. That's Dana talking to... Dana is on my floor too. She's such an archetypal gorgeous... I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. American girls I'd like to Be part of the world around you Driving a car by the seaside God, Samuel is such a weirdo. But I kind of figures Juliet would be dating Zachary. Jocks sucked up in the Vortex Club. Nobody can see my meltdown, except for me. <sighs> I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. OK, 
okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. It's cool, Nathan. Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just come to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. These pieces of time can frame us. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color. Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, Shit! Can you give me an example of a Damn, photographer I cannot who believe this. captured the human condition in black and white? Okay, if I'm crazy, I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the... Can you give me I actually did it. Photographer who perfectly captured I'm a the human, human time machine. Anybody? Bueller? Max, Diane. don't freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her Keep it together, Max. Faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. When I took my selfie, Jefferson She's asked me a question. Right? Wowzer, my old broken camera is new again. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. What is going on? Nothing has moved at all. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? You could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? What if Arvis chose to capture people at the height? Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming this. You all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl so isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please... Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not gonna get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me I after class. And I need time to save that girl. Types. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. 
Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind again and give him the right answer? Find detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American to Gary Ot Think, Max. Rewind and find something. I can't take it. I have to stop. Uh, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation... The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me.